I made money four different ways on Tesla due to its predictability. I'm going to teach you how I did it. This is my tactical stock scalper. All right, all right. Well, not in this account that you see here. I did it in a Webull uh, separate account, but I just use this one to show the chart because I like it much better. So what I did was I had $1,400 set aside. And when Tesla dropped a few days ago, right around in there, I bought 100 shares of Tesla at uh, $13.50. Okay, so then the next step, about two days ago, I bought puts on Tesla. Uh, Tesla was up around, I don't know, the 14... 30 mark ish, something like that, uh, 14, 20 mark, I don't know, something like that. And I bought $14 puts expiring October 20th. Now, why did I do that even though I own Tesla? That's because we know when the dividend drops or when they announce a dividend a couple days later, uh, Tesla will drop according to the dividend amount. So we know we're going to get a drop. It's guaranteed. Um, we just, you know, so so that that's guaranteed right there. So I, I bought a $14 put. So stay with me here. I have 100 shares of Tesla. Okay. I have uh, only bought one put, bought one put, uh, $14 strike two days ago. Okay. Now, the next thing I did was, was today because... TSLY we knew was going to drop uh, due to the uh, the dividend amount. So today I bought a $14 covered call set to be sold October 20th. So how did I make money? Four ways. Well, I'll tell you how. One was the put I sold this morning that I bought two days ago, okay, because we knew the drop was coming. Next, um, since I bought my shares at thirteen fifty, I'm making share price appreciation. So when it gets to fourteen, I'm going to collect the money from the covered call. I'm also going to make fifty dollars from thirteen fifty to fourteen, in addition to the dividends of holding a hundred shares of TSLY. Now, I noticed this last month that I could do this. And uh, so I, I waited till this month to make it happen. And, and it seems very, very predictable. Um, and this could be replicated possibly month over month. Now, let's just say TSLY does not get to $14. Well, that's okay. I'll still have the dividend, still made the money uh, from from buying the put, and then I, I sold it, and then I'll have the money from the covered call, right? Because that's put into your account um, straight away. And if Tesla starts dropping, um, and I can, you know, just buy back the covered call and make whatever from that. And I wouldn't make share price appreciation if it doesn't get to 14, of course, or if it gets below 1350, then I'd only make money three ways. But I think it's a great way and possibly going forward, I think I'm going to do this every month with TSLY and maybe some of the others too. I just noticed uh, on Tesla that I could do it last month. So I put the plan in motion this month. So if you don't mind, I'm going to go over it with you one more time. If you have any questions, please drop them in the comments. Two days ago, when Tesla got above 14, around 1420-ish, something like that, um, I don't know the exact price that I bought the put at, but I bought a $14 strike put knowing Tesla was going to drop due to the dividends, okay? I bought a Tesla a few days ago at 1350 on the drop. Today, I have a $14 covered call set to expire October 20th. And then I'm also making money from the dividends because I bought Tesla before the announcement. So, let me know what you think of my strategy of making money four ways on Tesla. 
Uh, I'd appreciate any comments and what you think and if you think it's feasible uh, to do this month after month. All right, this is my tactical stock scalper out.